Are you ready to give up on Jesus Christ because you continue to fail? Are you? Maybe you continue to cuss. Maybe you continue to fall into sexual sin. Maybe you continue to do things that are wrong. So maybe inside of your mind, you think to yourself that you are no good in trying to live for Jesus Christ because of your failures. That is not true. If you are trying to do what is right, even if you fail many times, never stop trying. If you never stop trying and trying to do what is right, do you believe God will turn you away? Why would he? Let's say you have been sinning for 20 years. Are you going to sit here and tell me that you can get rid of all of your sinful behavior within a day, within a week, within a year, five years, 10 years? No, I believe living for Jesus Christ is a constant, it should be, I believe, a constant progression. So if I am progressing in getting better in following God's rules, I believe that is what God is looking for. Thinking you are going to be perfect within minutes, hours, days, years, or whatever else like that, you are dreaming. You are listening to the wrong teacher or the wrong doctrine. Failure doesn't mean you are no good for Christ. Failure doesn't mean that you are no good in trying to become a Christian. No. In this life, I believe it is about progression, getting better, improving. Yes, I continue to cuss and not saying myself, but for an example. Yes, I continue to cuss and fornicate and fight people and, and do other horrible things, but I am trying. I am trying to change. I am fasting. I am praying. I am reading the Bible. I am asking God so many times to help me change. I am doing all those things plus more. I believe that is what God is expecting of us. Not so much perfection, even though he said to be perfect, but I believe he is looking for For you to never stop trying, no matter what comes your way. Let me stop here. God bless you.